Shenzhou 12, this is a report from Beijing. Now we would like to have General Secretary of CPC Central Committee, Chinese President, Chairman of the Central Military Commission, Xi Jinping, to talk with you. Copy. Salute. Comrade Nie Hai Sheng. Comrade Liu Bo Ming. Comrade Tang Hong Bo. Thank you for your hard work. On behalf of CPC Central Committee, State Council, Central Military Commission, and people of all ethnic groups in China, I would like to extend my sincere greetings to you all. Thank you. General Secretary, thank you all the Chinese people. You are the first crew to station in Tianhe core module. You will be staying in the space for three months. How's your work in the space and how's your life there? All Chinese people care about you. How's your physical condition? How's your life? Is the work going well? Thank you, General Secretary. We're in good health condition. The work is going well. It is my third time to participate in the space flight mission. Now the environment in the space is getting better. And for the Chinese astronauts, we have a home in the space. We are staying in the space, and we are proud of our motherland. For me, I'm the second time to participate in the space flight mission. I should have a responsibilities and feel very proud to participate in this mission. And later, we will operate the robotic arms and two types of extravehicular activities. We will do our best to make sure we can fulfill all the tasks successfully. It is my first time to enter into the space. Now I'm getting used to the space environment. Also now I have a very normal daily routine. I can also have a video call with my family members. Our space family is very comfortable. We are confident to deliver all the subsequent missions. Good. We see you are in good condition. We are very happy to see you well. To build a space station is an important milestone for China's aerospace course. It will help the human beings to better utilize the resources in the space. So for the new era, you are the representative of the astronauts and aerospace staff in China. I hope you can work together, stay united, and work diligently to complete the subsequent missions successfully. Wish all of you well in your work and life in the space. In Beijing, all of us look forward to your return with victory. We will bear your instructions in mind. We will live up to the mission and we will be determined to fulfill all the tasks and the missions. Rest assured. Salute.
，一立。神舟十二号，我是北京。Sun Zhou Chuan, this is Beijing, and the video call is completed. Please continue your subsequent missions. Sun Zhou Twelve, understand? Sun Zhou Twelve, understand? There you had the Chinese president making an Earth to space video call to the three Chinese astronauts on board the Tiangong space station. Uh, the president just extended his greetings to the crew, congratulating them on a successful mission so far, asking them how they felt working and living there in space. The astronauts each responded to the president a brief video call, but full of symbolism as the Communist Party of China prepares to celebrate the centenary of its founding in just a few days. I mean, this is history being made a great milestone for the country. There you see the president waving. To the engineers and scientists there at the Beijing Aerospace Flight Control Center.